As a black man with a darker complexion, it can be tough to achieve glass skin when most of the advice out there isn't tailored for us. We're a little different. We're unique. From our hair to our skin to even our skincare, we need products and a routine that understands our unique needs. You need a routine that addresses the most prominent problems we face as black men, like dark spots, hyperpigmentation, eczema, razor bumps, and hyperpigmentation caused by shaving. Unfortunately, a lot of skincare products aren't tailored for our rich melanated skin. From sunscreen to moisturizer, we've often been left out. But don't worry because in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get vibrant glass skin with a routine that's specifically made for black men. By following this video step by step, it will leave your skin looking so radiant and smooth that it almost appears to be glass. Step one, routine. Don't just have one skincare routine, have two. You can kind of think of it like brushing your teeth. You're not only brushing it in the morning, but you're also brushing at night. This keeps your teeth clean and doubles your cleaning effectiveness. The same goes for your skin. Have a routine in the morning as well as one at nighttime. This will keep your skin clean, clear, and hydrated throughout the entire day, as well as after it providing you with 24 hour protection, hydration, and a 24 hour glow. When it comes to your routines, I recommend not just doing the same thing for both. Your morning routine should consist of a cleanser, an exfoliator, a face serum, a moisturizer, and a sunscreen. And your night routine should mainly focus on cleansing, moisturizing, and renewing the skin. You wanna be sure that your morning routine and night routine are a bit different from each other. As your morning routine is focused on protecting you from external elements throughout the day, and your night routine is mainly focused on keeping your skin fresh and hydrated throughout the entire night. So you want a routine that goes something like this. In the morning, you would first cleanse your face using a gentle face wash. You don't want something too stripping as that could completely dry out your skin. Instead, try something that's gentle while still being effective and providing you with hydration. I'd recommend CeraVe's Renewing Cleanser. You know those stubborn dark marks that's inside your skin that literally just never go away? Well, this is gonna help with that. This cleanser contains BHA and salicylic acid, which are two very important ingredients because they both help to fade stubborn dark marks. So you won't just be cleansing your face, you'll also be helping to wash away those stubborn uneven areas. Next, you wanna exfoliate. Instead of using harsh traditional exfoliators like a face scrub, use a chemical one. Chemical exfoliators put a lot less strain on your skin and are significantly more effective since these exfoliators are actually designed to exfoliate deep underneath your skin where normal exfoliators can't get to. For this, I recommend Paola's Choice 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliant. This exfoliator helps to unclog your pores as well as smooth and even your skin tone. It also contains BHA and salicylic acid as well. So we're really doubling the effectiveness of getting rid of those stubborn dark marks and hyperpigmentation. Just be sure to keep in mind not to overdo it. You only wanna exfoliate your skin once or twice every week. Anything more than that is overkill. After exfoliating, you wanna follow up with a vitamin C serum. Vitamin C serums help to brighten your skin as well as give you a little protection from the sun. When it comes to using vitamin C serum, you wanna make sure you're using a powerful one, like La Roche-Posay's 10% Pure Vitamin C Serum. I recommend this one not only because it contains salicylic acid, but it also has anti-aging properties. It's important to incorporate products that help to fight off aging so that you can continue to keep a youthful, vibrant glow. Next, it's time to moisturize. When it comes to moisturizing, you don't have to be too specific, you just wanna make sure to use a moisturizer that's hydrating enough to give you 24 hour hydration. You also wanna consider how heavy or how thick your moisturizer might be. I highly recommend going with something that's lightweight, not sticky, and leaves you with a healthy, glossy finish. Try Biome Moisturizing Gel Cream. It contains zero harmful parabens, it's extremely lightweight, and provides your skin with 24 hour hydration. Oh 
and it also meshes super well with other products. Last but definitely not least, we want to lock in all of our newly added radiance with a powerful sunscreen. I know a lot of you guys think because your skin's a little darker, you don't really have to wear sunscreen. But I'm sorry to break it to you, you do. We all do. The sun is harmful to everybody, and it's very important to protect your skin from it. The problem with sunscreen for people with melanated skin like you and me is that most sunscreens tend to leave a white cast over your skin. After applying it, you just kind of look dry and ashy because most sunscreens aren't really made with our complexion in mind. So instead of using traditional sunscreens that don't blend well with your skin, try using a completely clear one. For this, use Supergoop Unseen Sunscreen. This is a completely clear sunscreen that's lightweight and won't leave you with a white cast over your face. It also doesn't make your skin sticky and it's FPS 40. Using a sunscreen will help to lock in all of your newly added radiance, protect you from the sun, and leave your skin with a subtle, vibrant glow. Your night routine should be similar, but a little different. Incorporate aspects that your morning routine might be missing, like adding more anti-aging properties or products, or even doing a mask. Focus more on providing your skin with hydration and keeping it hydrated throughout the entire night. You may even want to consider switching over to a silk pillowcase to better help your skin stay hydrated. Step 2. Internal Skin Care It's super important to care for your skin from the outside but it's just as important to care for your skin from the inside as well. The state of your skin is often a reflection of your internal health. So to achieve and maintain healthy glass-like skin, you need to have a good diet. Your journey to glass skin begins from the inside out. Most skin imperfections and problems are directly correlated with what you eat. So if you're eating a bunch of unhealthy, fatty, and oily foods, your body will process them and it'll show externally. But if we change our diet and cut back on some of our favorite unhealthy foods, we'll see a significant improvement in our skin and overall image. Incorporate skin-friendly foods like carrots, walnuts, avocados, pumpkins, and tomatoes into your diet. These are all superfoods that are packed with essential nutrients that nurture your skin from within. They provide antioxidants that protect your skin, vitamins that boost collagen production, and minerals that strengthen and revitalize your skin's health. And also, be sure to eat plenty leafy greens and stay hydrated. Don't ever underestimate the power of water. Drinking at least 3 to 4 liters of water a day can bless your skin with a glassy, radiant glow. Water acts as a natural cleanser, flushing out impurities and creating an optimal environment for new, healthy skin cells to thrive. You can think of your skin like a flower. It needs nutrients and hydration to bloom. And without it, just like a flower, it'll wither away. It will appear lifeless and dull. So be sure to be mindful of what you're putting in it and on it. Step three, external skincare. Now that you've got a skin routine and you're caring for your skin internally, it's time to care for your skin externally as well. I'm saying you need to watch what you're putting on it. Skin is actually very, very sensitive and any little thing can upset it and cause irritation your skin will quite literally absorb anything put on it. And I mean anything. So we need to be more careful and cautious on what we let touch our skin. A bad habit that a lot of us have is touching our face. Whenever handling your skin, you always wanna make sure that you have freshly cleaned hands. Something as simple as carrying hand sanitizer or washing your hands before making contact can dramatically help improve your skin and help avoid any unwanted impurities like pimples or acne. You also wanna be aware of where you decide to lay your head. It's very easy to get comfortable and not be concerned with where you're choosing to lay your head down. For example, if you're at school and you wanna take a quick rest, you might sit your head or lay it on a desk. Or you might be at someone's house and lay your head down on a pillow or a comforter. Areas like this can be nesting grounds for bacteria and other various germs. And because skin is so sensitive, you can almost guarantee that it will be easily irritated. So be more mindful of where you choose to lay your head. You want to make sure you're switching out your pillowcases every single week. 
I highly, highly recommend switching over to a silk pillowcase. Unlike cotton pillowcases, which can be rough on your skin, silk is gentle, soft, and smooth. And it causes less friction between your skin and your pillowcase, which reduces the likelihood of skin irritation. Also, unlike cotton, silk doesn't absorb moisture from your skin and your hair. Instead, it helps you to retain it helping your skin to stay hydrated and preventing it from drying out while you sleep. So if you haven't already switched over to a silk pillowcase, I would highly suggest that you do so. But by having a solid structured morning and night routine and caring for your skin both from the inside and out, you can have luminous, flawless glass skin in no time. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, go ahead and hit the like button. And if you haven't already, subscribe and turn on post notifications so that you can continue to see our videos and get your weekly dose of betterness. And remember, with every single one of our videos that you watch, you take one step closer to becoming an even better version of yourself. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, stay smooth like butter.